everyone, good morning. Welcome to Costumes in a Cuppa. Um, I'm Kat and this is the lovely Becca. Hello. <laughs> um, so if you have not joined us before, um, we're IDS, International Dance Supplies, and this is our series, Costumes in a Cuppa, where we take you through a collection of our costumes each week and give you ideas for your themes, for your shows, and just give you a little bit of inspiration, really. This week, we are still working through our 2025 launched collection. These are all available to purchase now through the website. They're all in stock. They're all available to order. This week, we're going to be focusing on themes. So all of the costumes that we've picked for this week suit themselves really well to a themed dance. We know lots of teachers love to theme their shows and helps tie everything together helps give the kids something, a character to get into so that they really invest in the dance and bring out their performance qualities. So we love a theme. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what we're going to kick off with. Just a reminder before we get started, we are running a competition this series. Um, so for every comment that's put into the videos, um, you will be entered into a prize draw. And in our last session before Christmas, you could be in for the chance of winning a mystery box of costumes from us. So definitely get commenting. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, but first of all, this week, I just want to tell you that I know lots of you are going to be preparing for your Christmas shows. It's a busy yeah. time, isn't it? Kat? It is a busy time. Um, so I know you're going to be looking for those Christmas themed costumes. Now, please, if you just go onto the website, you're going to see some fabulous yes. Christmas themed costumes there. Look, as we can see. Um, so yeah, we've also got some amazing Revolution special order right from America Christmas themed costumes. Yeah. So just be sure to place your order, you know, in the next couple of weeks because it can take up to four weeks for them to arrive because they yeah. are a fantastic special order service. Yes. So yeah, make sure you check out our website for that. They've got some gorgeous ones in there for like rocket themed dances yes. and that is just... Just live your rocket dream Christmas with a Revolution dreams. costume, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> So I will take us on to our first costume today, which is a Christmas sort of themed costume. So this has actually been one of our most popular styles since we've launched the collection. So this is a gorgeous little tutu in a really lovely crisp white and bright red. So you've got the metallic red, which just really pops and has that lovely shine to it. Um, as you can see on the close up there, that it's got a whole lace kind of overlay on the lycra on the leotard this is absolutely inundated with um, iridescent sequins so under the lights it's going to capture whatever light color you pop on there and it's really really going to shine under them and then on this on the skirt you've got three layers of a really nice kind of robust net so it's gonna have that lovely kind of bouncy wavy shape which we love it's got a lace um binding on one of them and then a sequin binding on the other and then just a nice simple back the sleeves can be kind of ruched so they're right on the shoulder or they can be ruched so that they're off the shoulder and as you can see there they have got a little spaghetti strap underneath so that you've got that little bit of support and it helps with sizing as well so it gives a, a little bit more kind of like a tighter fit to the costume so it stays on and in place there it's not just the kind of metallic sleeve which is lovely Perfect for Christmas, perfect for little snow kind of fairies. It's just so snowy, isn't it? It's very snowy, <laughs> but it's also, if you're doing something like Mrs. Claus, you could put a little elf hat on there. It would just be gorgeous. A little pair of red tap shoes. Yeah, you could just go on and on. You could. You? <laughs> I love that. So that's that one for you. There we go. So moving on to your kind of classic fairy butterfly themed here. Yeah. This is absolutely perfect for your dinky dots in all of your ballet classes. This comes from an extra small. So I know lots of you, you know, everybody's starting ballet earlier and earlier, yep. aren't they? Which is just fantastic. So you can include them in your shows. Um, it's got the gorgeous yellow, blue, well, yellow, purpley blue and pink as well on the netted skirt. And the kind of, they're almost kind of like printed stickers, the stars on there under yeah. the stage light. It's gorgeous. You've also got on the back um, a bow detail as well. Now this comes in purple, yellow, and of course the pink. So this is fantastic because you can match obviously the colors of the net here. You can have a massive class all in different colors yeah. or if you want to distinguish the different class levels, you can have one in purple, one in pink, one in yellow. Yeah. Now to accessorize this one, we have added these gorgeous wings which also come in, obviously we've got the pink, yellow, and the purple. So you can match it to the color costume, which is great. That and comes as a set, this is a set so it's a one. wing and one set. So in each packet, you get a pair of wings and a wand, so perfect for your fairies. We love that, and we love wands for little ones, don't we, Kat? Because yeah. 
we know a lot's busy. going on with hands and dancing. So keeps you know, them busy. Keeps them busy. <laughs> But it's a prop. we love a prop on the little ones, and I'm sure we all your teachers do as well. So that is a great set to have along with the fairy costume. Yeah, and they, the colours match perfectly. We've also got the yes. butterfly wings as well. Now, these actually are our favourite. I'm not just yeah. saying here. Look at these. Hold that one up for me. Yeah. So these just simply go around oh, through the arms okay. here. That way. So it's really comfy. They're not, um, sometimes they can be quite harsh, can't they? Butterfly yeah. props. But it's literally just a simple strap. And yeah. again, their hands are busy because you just hold on to the little loop there. And look at that, you're a butterfly, it's amazing. <laughs> so yeah, these also come in the various colours as well. Yes. Um, going on to a lovely little kind of jive, think grease, think rock and roll with this one. It's, a, it's a, quite a short skirt and it's got the black two layer net underlay there. Over the top you've got, it's a softer, silkier fabric. So it has got that metallic shine, but it is a softer fabric on there. So as they're kind of doing their flicks, their jumps, their kicks, it's gonna have that movement that you want from a rock and roll costume. Mm. Then you've got the really striking pink belt on there. That's a, a light crest, so it will move with them. It's not gonna restrict as they're popping it on or off or anything. Um, sequin bodice on the front of the leotard, then a nice high back. It's got adjustable straps. We love an adjustable strap. <laughs> they're brilliant. We say it every time, but they're so yeah. fantastic for your sizing. Um, so yeah, so you've got those on there and it's on a leotard base as well. So as I said, grease, hairspray, yeah. anything with a rock and roll theme, which we know are really popular. You could yeah, even pop a little pair of kind of the winged pink glasses on and it's got a bit of a Patty Simcox Definitely. going on, which yeah. is, we love. Hand jive, any yeah. of those. They're the sort of thing that kids always love to do. They've, it, it's something about yeah. that music, something about getting into those characters that is just timeless. They just love it, don't they? Definitely. Definitely timeless. You can't go wrong. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so moving on to this tutu with the sewn-in mesh shirt there. Now, this is a fantastic edgy costume. Yeah. More and more people are doing, you know, edgy covers of songs or those kind of neoclassical um, vibes as well. Mm -hmm. I just want to shout out as well, Nicole and Kat was actually at CYD, yes. um, was it last weekend or the week before, um, and they watched Lane Theatre Arts um, do a fantastic Madonna, Madonna yeah. piece, um, but it was really eerie, wasn't it? Yeah. I've seen the video since. And they were all in black, and I just think that would be perfect for a Madonna Edgy it's giving to dance. 80s, isn't it? Yeah, or 80s. It's giving <laughs> 80s, 80s punk. Now, I wouldn't necessarily put this with your classic ballet shoe. I would put this with a combat boot, mm -hmm. or again, if you were doing that sort of Madonna theme, I'd put it with a character heel. Yeah. Um, you know, jazz boot, anything like that. Or if you wanted to do kind of a sassy point number, a black point shoe, bare leg. Yeah. That's the kind of vibe I see there. Yeah. Now Definitely. this is actually sewn in to the tutu here, so that's great because nobody's messing around. No t-shirts coming out, which yeah. I know a teacher's pet hates, aren't they? When yeah. you know things are moving about, <laughs> and it's nice and secure. Nothing worse for your pupils when they've got something that's distracting them in their costume. You just want them to be on stage yeah. focusing on their dancing, don't you? So it's great to have the t-shirt effect but not obviously have a t-shirt underneath. It's properly yeah. sewn in there and made for dancing, of yeah. course. We've got a couple of props yes. um, or a couple of accessories that would be great for those. So you could do a little punk glove, which would just add, that's a netted punk glove. Really good That would boot. add to the 80s sort of vibe. Or we do these gorgeous kind mm. of netted almost effect masks and that would be a really cool black swan Yeah, great if you're doing vibe. a point number, wouldn't it? Yeah, definitely. So, going on to, again, another of our bestsellers at this point since we've launched the collection, and you can see why, it's <laughs> gorgeous. So, you've got the really striking red um, checkered effect on the, on the top here, and then you've got the red of the skirt underneath, and I think that works really well to make it nice and striking. This is a denim effect, so it is actually a really soft lycra material. There's nothing kind of harsh about that, which is the brilliance having a dance specific costume. If you get something like this off a high street shop, yes, online, it. anything like that, it's not built for dancing. This is built for dancing and it's built to stretch, to complement movements. It's all in there. You've got the nice laced detail around the edge and then the corset sort of effect with the ribbon there. On the back, you've just got a nice scooped back and then 
again, the denim on the back there as well. Perfect for your little Calamity Janes, Oklahoma, anything that's got that kind of country theme, you could even take it into Toy Story. We do yeah, I think a little fabulous. cowboy hat to go with that one as well. So gorgeous little tap number with the hats, be perfect. Really good. Lovely, so moving on to the leotard here with the gorgeous asymmetrical skirt. Now, I bet you're thinking, why is this in themes? Well, this yeah. can be in so many themes, okay? Because of the striking red colour, this yeah. could be great for any sort of Spanish-themed or yeah. salsa. But we actually realised, didn't we, Kat? Yeah. This <laughs> is pretty much exactly the same costume that the leading girl wears in the film Centre Stage. Great film. It, yeah, it's It's a favourite. It, definitely our favourite. <laughs> So yeah, in the final song of that, this is great. And I know a lot of dance schools actually use that music. So, mm -hmm. you know, as a soloist or as a whole group, that would be really striking. You got that one there. Now also, I think about the song Roxanne from Moulin Rouge, yes. you know, something really, really gritty and great. Yeah. But we know a lot of people, you know, Moulin Rouge has come back and everything. Lots of people do a medley number. So yeah. this is where this comes in here. Yes. Obviously you've got the skirt here, so you can do a Roxanne number, but then you can go straight in to... Can I see how smooth we can make this transition? Right, let's, let's see if we can do this. Yes, okay. Nearly, tuck her in. So that's a really quick change. That it? is a really super quick change. So, so you've got change, two looks. You have got a can-can. This now looks this great as the top. Yeah. And then you've got your can-can skirt. And that is your full so it changes. Moulin Rouge medley. If Sorted. you wanted to go further. <laughs> We've got a feathered headdress and that is a full Moulin Rouge outfit sorted. So you can do, as Becca said, your tango, your Roxanne, something with a bit more lyrical flair. Then if you want to do the full on Can Can afterwards or beforehand, you've yeah. got a switched up look. And just I know a lot a of you of use the Can Can as your final number for your shows. It's kind of like a tradition. Whereas like this year you're thinking, what else can we do? Yeah. You could add the Roxanne number beforehand yeah. also as well. We've also got these fabulous fans come in various colours. Yeah. Again, would be great for the Roxanne part there yeah. as well. It's amazing. I love the music from Moulin Rouge as well. The musical, the uh, new, original yeah. movie, fantastic as well. But I think the music for the musical just really gets you want to dance. Exactly. It gets you wanting to dance and yeah. move, doesn't it? Yeah, so you could it? use the new version and then obviously back to the traditional for the Can Can. Yeah. This is a great, great fusion. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Taking you on to... This clown, sort of Harlequin inspired number here. So it's a bike tard, so it's on shorts. And then you've got the really striking stripey leotard, the kind of lapel look, and then the buttons at the front. So there's a lot of detail going on. The lapels have got a sequin trim, lots of detail, lots of interest happening. Then on the back, you've got almost the lapels go into like a halter neck, and then you've got the two straps coming down at the back. Nice high kind of, um, line at the back so you can hide any bras, hide any support that needs to be in there. And then it's a three layer um, peplum sort of style skirt at the back there. So you get, this be great for acro yeah, because so. the skirt is gonna be out of the way. It's not gonna affect any lifts. It's not gonna affect any tricks, floor work. They're not gonna be tripping as they're standing mm. up. And I think it just lends itself to contortion, yeah, and kind for of, those like into ages, yes. you know, eight, nine, ten, yeah. you kind of still want to put them in a theme for their acro rather yeah. than just do, say, say, a dance. So that is a great theme, isn't it? It is, definitely. Corporate. You can With do something costume. a bit quirky. You could do something kind of classic like The Greatest Showman. It really works yeah. into that kind of Or you could do it a bit more commercially, show time. couldn't you? And do yeah. like a Britney Spears circus. Ooh, add a boot. Yeah. Love add it. And again, you can even incorporate yeah break. your netted gloves Little accessories as well. like that yeah perfect okay so my final one today is probably our most requested one isn't it, it yes definitely so <laughs> you probably recognize the style of tutu this is our most popular velour little tutu here. Yeah. Now we do this in various colours, but mm -hmm. it was requested that we did it in a brown. Yeah. So we listened and we have now done that. So we give you this one here. Yeah. Now this is great. We know a lot of you love animal themes for yes. your little ones. Um, so we've done it in the brown theme so it can cover so many animals. So you've got yeah. your bears, haven't you? You do, that's your bears. You've got your bear little here. Bear <laughs> Look at that, instantly a bear. There you go. 
little monkeys. A little monkey there as well. So this comes as a set. It's got the ears and it's got the tail. So you can just tack the tail on or just a little safety pin would do that there. Cute. And then with the ears as well. Yeah, Complete and great. Set. I know a lot of you love Jungle Book as well. Mm -hmm. We've had a lot of showroom visits, haven't we? Yes. Um, asking for Jungle Book. Yeah. So yeah, you've got that base there. Yeah, and it works for Charlie and the Chocolate Factory as well. So yes, with obviously the chocolate. new film coming out, that's been really popular. It's got great music. Um, so little chocolate bars, little little chocolates. Yeah, <laughs> and of course like with a headband or some of yeah. our hair accessories. I just want to reiterate as well, make sure you go online and yeah. check our accessories mm -hmm. um, tab on the website because we're constantly adding to it, aren't we? We are, yeah. And yeah, pretty much anything you need is on there. So make sure you check that out as Definitely. well. Fabulous. There we go. So that was our themes week next week the fabulous kate is going to be joining um with becca because we're going to be off at our photo shoot week which is so yes. exciting Great we will week. make sure to give you some behind the scenes of what's happening because we're bringing you more costumes in january as if there wasn't enough yep we've added enough. so much newness this year and we've got even more coming out in january which is super exciting so kate will be joining next week and you're going to you're going to be looking at younger costumes so things that are great for your little ones yeah new ideas, lovely themes, because um, we've got heaps of those in the new current collection, yes, the current new collection. The new, new, new one. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, just please make sure if you've got a show coming up, um, let us know and get booked into our showroom because we'd Definitely. absolutely love to help you costume your okay. next show. Um, and like we said at the start, make sure you comment below yep. to be in a chance to winning our prize draw. Yes, that's it from us and have a great week. Have a wonderful week. Thank you. Bye-bye.